Welcome back to The Walking Dead. When we last left off, I um, had gone to the St. John Dairy Farm, and someone was asking me a question, but I was running out of time, so I just paused it. So here we go. I don't even remember what the question was, but we'll see. Um, to the rest of us, so we're, mm, we brought gasoline. Thanks for having us. We brought some gasoline on good faith. That's good enough. We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Best fresh this morning. Amazing. Biscuits! Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, <gasps> mm, that's for sure. Biscuits are now, good. Now, hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long Maybelle while. Maybell must be the Your cow. cow is sick? <coughs> what she... We have a vet. You could bring her here. Shut up, Mark. Out. Oh my a god. Vet? Oh my god. Oh my. Our prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group will come for the day. Wait, Mark. How about this? No. Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Oh my god. Mark, you are a why freaking don't I retard. The food and round up everyone for the trip over here. Might want to take someone oh with you. Remember, those roads can be oh dangerous. Oh my gosh. I can handle myself. Take this. <coughs> Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Mark, what in the world is wrong with you? I swear. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help. I don't want everybody here. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. <sighs> you can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're Hopefully ready. I'll learn a way you out. Gotcha. A quick, easy this way out. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? <sighs> Let's make sure the place Before is safe. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Yeah. Right. Obviously they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence yeah. perimeter sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. All right, sounds good. Let's do this. Mm, do, do, do. I don't want to talk to him. I just talk to him. Look over here at the broken swing. Excuse me. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. When was the last time it got <coughs> loose? Mm, been <coughs> quite a while. I don't exactly have a lot of kids visiting anymore. I look forward to the <coughs> day when kids can just be kids again. Amen to that. Yeah, whatever. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat. Some rope, make it safe for Clem and Duck, <coughs> and let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. I still don't trust them. Can I fix it? I need some rope, and there's got to be a board around here I can use oh, okay. to see. Um, let's walk this way. Nothing over here. Walk this way. Anything? Okay, let's just go up that way. <coughs> Excuse me. What's over here? Shoe bucket? Um, that's what we call a storage <laughs> chest. <laughs> okay, found some rope. Um, yeah, let's look at the awards. Not that I care. This dairy won a lot of ribbons in its day, huh? Okay. This place was my daddy's life. Meant everything to him. You know, when he first bought this place, it was a single-story house. Is that right? Mm. After us kids were born, care. he insisted on adding a second floor. <coughs> Said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. <laughs> Mama, she was done after dad. <laughs> my folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left for daddy. That's why we take such good care of it, and... 
why we want to share it with good folks like yourself. You don't know that we're good folks. You haven't talked to all of us. You don't know. I still do not trust you. Not at all. Let's see what's over this way. Wind chimes. Used to have these on the front porch of my house growing up. Well, the noise doesn't attract any unwanted guests. Here's a wind chime. Seriously, it's not like somebody's gonna be shooting around. Mm, fresh Shoot, <laughs> shoot around. So gonna be okay, well, let's go in, I guess. There, Lee. What can I do for you, <coughs> sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. Okay. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. Um, this place looks amazing. I'll just go amazing through the, job this thing, place up. Through the <laughs> options. Now, aren't you sweet? Thank you, Lee. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we still keep some of our old routines to help remind us of better times. I hope you guys can't hear me swallowing. It's kind of weird. Oh no! What happened <laughs> to the rest of you, Sam? I didn't mean to hit that. Share tragedy here, just like everyone else, I'm sure. Some of our staff took off to find their family as soon as they heard the news. The few that stuck around, well, we lost most of them the first night, so. <coughs> Things showed up. It was a tough night. Sorry, I just heard something. You heard it too, didn't you, buddy? What's out there? It looks custom built. Nice of you to notice. My husband put a lot of work into this old house. Well, he did a fantastic <coughs> job. I believe in making a house a home. When will dinner be ready? That's all I care right? about. It'll be a while spill, but it'll be worth it. It'll be worth it, trust me. You sound like a wicked witch. How is your family holding up? How's your family been holding up since, uh, you know? All my boys have been my saving grace. They both left their jobs and came home to help out after the attack started happening. I think it was hardest on Andy. Dan was always more of a mama's boy, but don't tell him I said that. <laughs> Well, if anything comes up that I can help you, feel free <laughs> Just to Just rolled my eyes. Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. Okay. They won't let me in the house, though. Suspicious. <laughs> Sorry, I still don't trust these people. They have all of this room, and they just happen to come to the perfect place to get the gas and everything. Hmm. Can I use one of these? This is too big right now. Oh. But if I can find something to cut it down to size, this might make a Why am I fixing the swing? Sleep. We don't know we're gonna sit here. Gonna stay here, whatever. Hmm. A saw. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. He looks weird. He's got very deep set eyes. Creepy. That looks about, about right. Now, um... Let's go back this way. Why does it still have a cracker sign? I don't have any more food, do I? Hmm. Maybe I do. Oh, I guess I should talk to Mark first real quick. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that was helpful. Thanks, Mark. I'm so glad I talked to you. Oh, let's repair it. Yep, that's what I want to do right there. Can you let me do it? All okay. right, this shouldn't be too tough. <clears throat> well, I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it too. <laughs> Did you say something, darling? Oh my goodness. <laughs> my goodness. Just trying to help out a bit around here. 
You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, <sighs> it does. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um. There was another little piece of fence. I don't know if I actually touched it or not. So. Right there. Can I go up to that and look at it, please? Oui. Really? Oui. Hmm. Pointy. Am I going to have to stake somebody with that? Hmm. Maybe. What's that? Oh, okay. <coughs> Let's look at the fence. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Hmm. Yep. Can't take any chances when it comes to safety. He sounds kind of familiar. Doop, doop, doop. <laughs> Walk weird. Okay, let's talk to him. Wait, let's look at the generator. <coughs> What's that? Generator. <laughs> you guys come along with gas just in time. Okay. Hey, uh, don't mess with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky, and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. Mm -hmm. um. Oh, I don't want to go up there. Wonder how much food they've got in there. Hopefully, we'll find mm -hmm. out. Okay. Can I go back over here and talk to him? Wait, what is this? Use gate. Oh, let's talk to him first. Hi. Hi. <laughs> well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. Jeez, I come on. Something's got to happen. You folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Uh, how many weapons do you They've have? scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about Turn yourselves? Tables. What kind of protection do you have around here? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, mm. the fence is all we need to keep us safe. Okay, so they have guns. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. I guess that makes sense. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers. None of them stayed. <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches <coughs> sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are gross. enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together. <coughs> together like us. <coughs> okay, let's go Mark fix the perimeter. I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. Ugh. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay Sounds here and gross. finish up with the generator. Sounds so gross. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Okay. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. You never know. Okay. I need to pause it soon, so hopefully nothing too big happens. God, this has been a boring episode. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty so amazing boring. what we've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. <sighs> I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. <coughs> What's up with you telling him what I said about him thinking I'm dangerous? Yeah, dude. Look, you said it. You even admitted it right to him. <clears throat> I try to be civil at least. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. Ew. There's one. Why is there an arrow in it? Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Um, what's that? Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? I hope it so. It better be. Who do you think he was? 
Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I guess I should push him. Looks like he's stuck. Um. Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Mm. Either way, hope he was already dead. Um, can I touch it? <laughs> can I touch it? Pull it out. Disgusting. Yep, sure is. Come on. Okay. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. I hope it was Once dead. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? I don't really like this guy that much, but whatever. Um. Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. Yeah. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas. Mm. Easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty <clears throat> well. Um. What do you mean by that? Yeah. I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. Okay. That's all. Thanks. There's another one. I see it. Ew. Is it wearing track shorts? Gross. Gross track shorts. She's nasty. Uh oh. Um. Man, the fence burned right into his hands. Ew. I think they fused together. Ew. Um. Ew. <laughs> That's nasty. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Nope. That's gross. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Christ. You sounded Thanks for the yeah, very effeminate. It's not there. easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Mm. <sighs> I'm hungry too. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're going to be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Mm. Okay. Come on. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must yep. have knocked it over trying to get through. <clears throat> He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> okay. Um. If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna <laughs> happen. Come on. Okay, let's look at this. I like the way I gingerly step over it. He just jumps over. Oh, oops, Q. Okay. Did I get it? Yeah. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Uh oh. What the? Get to the gate. Oh crap. Get down! You asshole! Jesus! What the hell am I supposed to do? What's going on? Now you Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? Uh oh. On that I kid, need to pause it out. too. Food, you uh uh okay. I gotta I gotta pause it and I'll come back and figure this out when I get done. So until then. Don't bye.